And on top of this, she's also been for many years the chairman of the European Cultural Foundation. And if that isn't enough, there is also a list, as long as my arm, of all the organizations that the Princess supports by being a patron for them. Your Royal Highness, I have a great respect for you. You are a wonderful example of somebody who has chosen public service above a life of comfort and luxury. And now I'd like to invite you to come and do the ceremony. In our world, um, in our world of mass media, the nursing profession, I don't think you can hear me well, is this better? Okay, thank you. In our world of mass media, the nursing profession usually does not stand in the center of attention. Only during the, during the corona <coughs> epidemic, the media put the spotlight on nurses who were performing their work under tremendously stressful circumstances. Nurses were applauded for their untiring efforts to cope with this epidemic of such great magnitude. A well-deserved acknowledgement indeed. But after the epidemic, all the attention has faded away. This conference of the practitioners of your special profession puts you in the limelight now. Uh, and not just your professionalism, but also your dedication for your, pa for your patients. And yet, you are, on average, not seen. <laughs> <laughs> yes. well, the